I do need to finish the other upgrade that the engineers were doing. You're quite right. Actually, I went in there to look at engineers, didn't I? And so we're going to need... Okay, so you're... These two... These two need to come out and, and take a rest. You can go in. Prefer to work in the engineering depot. So you can come over there. And he'll be happy. And we need that morale recovery. No preference, no preference. No preference. And they're fine. So on 24-hour shifts, working like mad. Which we are starting to do okay with. Right, let's, let's take a look. I'll let them rest, and then we'll... Actually, if I do... Mm. They're going to do a bit of work on it. We'll keep one. We'll keep one ticking away and keep one spare because we will need to put someone in this. So I was looking at or going to look at. Can't remember what I was going to go and look at. There was something else I was going to check. Oh, yes. Yes, that's what it is. We're going to look at this. That's okay. We've got people waiting. This one is not going to survive. So they can go in next. And he'll be exhausted, but that's that's okay. We can we can deal with that as long as we get him through. Uh, sorry, Commander, uh, Commander uh, Geridos. I didn't see the end. You disabled V-Sync and it fixed your pop-up and quest issue. Oh, nice. Okay. You had to restart. You're also running the game as an admin. That's good news. Hey, Nathan. Could you look at the trauma ward? You think one had a skull? Ah, well spotted. Yeah, I've just got in there, just ahead of you. Well, actually, you were ahead of me. I just didn't read the comment in time. I don't think we need a scout team to fetch the truck. I don't think so. But I don't know how that truck's working. I need to recruit yeah, a second scout team. But there's not much I can do about that at the moment, sadly. So, let's get some more good news. Shorter operation. Because it's a nice clean wound. Okay, let's speed things back up. We're just waiting now, I Death. think, for... Engineers reached the pharmacy. Oh, the, 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 the engineers are tired. Death. Already. Um, I do kind of need him... in there, so... This is the trauma stuff, isn't it? Actually, I probably need him more on there. The alcohol is... Well, we're maintaining the alcohol. We're just about maintaining the food by working 12-hour shifts Sir, there. Engineer is on the way. Sir, medics are on the way. Let me have a look at my housing. Sir, patient... patient died? Patient cured, were you going to say? So, I can... We can have the physician when we get the opportunity. We're maxed on medics. Um, engineers we can afford more of. We've got housing space. Nurses, we're good for a bit. And scouts. I'd like the scout. So, what do we do? Patient's room is unexpectedly clean. There's an extremely low chance that it would get infected. Do you know what? We're, this, this, is, this is beneficial. Let's, let's do this. Yeah, we lost a few people there. It was, it was sad. It was in the ADS. So that's what we need to work on. We need to get the ambulances. We need to get the more, all the medics thrown into that, I think, when the big battles start. Uh, nice. This was high spirits. I'm going to go check this again. Just to see how everyone's doing. It looks, uh, it looks good so far. There's a stable one. Okay, you need to come up there. It's just a case of balancing these out. And on the chemical ward, that's good. And on here, uh, everyone's good. And I think they're going to make a full recovery. Sir, operation was successful. And we're keeping up on that. And I, would, I just need these so I can start upgrading Sir, and spending the resources. Secured. That's what I need. So this should be filling up nicely. 
this is going to give us oh this is this is what we like to see so over the next day we're going to have a ton of these coming through nice 20 oh that's going to be so good Sir, patient is cured. we can do some big upgrades on that so we're missing the um, oxygen tanks i think for this Patient's torso was pierced with a bayonet, major lung damage, and he's barely breathing. We don't have any options for that, unfortunately. However, the gas agent was diluted, not as strong, so this is save some supplies or do the procedure by the book. Save supplies and also shorter yeah, operation. operation was successful. And a lot of the time, it's just getting those operations down quicker that really matters. Sir, we lost this patient. All right, hang on. Hang on, we, we're losing people. Slow down a minute whilst I have a think about this. So what we can do, because the food is, is not looking great, I'm going to spend one. And that just keeps us above that minimum level whilst we get other things upgraded. So we now have points to spend. This requires, this is the advanced dressing station. Let's get that improved. Uh, in staff lodging and upgrading, we, we have people working. This is 18 hours. We kind of need to get that one done, but I need to put someone in to start with. And let's see, I need to, I need, I need more engineers. These key, these guys keep, seem to be key. I'll have a look at the schedule. Yeah. So this is. We're on top of things now. Let's put this on 12-hour shifts and hopefully people aren't going to be overly exhausted by it. So what we'll do, we're on 12.57 a.m. That's still a long time to go, isn't it? He has no preference. He has no preference. Let's switch these guys out. That works well. He can have a rest. Um... Actually, if they're on 12 hour shifts, I can afford to have them just one in there. I think. So, let's have a look. Does anyone want to work in the engineering depot? Alright, he's fine there. Because what we should do is put another guy into there. And get this thing finished. This is the thing that really is slowing us. And then uh, we are short on... He needs to come out so he can go in there. And we put him in there on a 12-hour shift. We hope that works. The food we need to produce. We need to get this down to 11 hours. It's still a fairly big... Still a fairly big piece of work. All right. So is there anyone in here? Give me all these drafts. And then we've got stuff to spend. And we should be good again. Better to finish the engineer's update so you can hire one more and use it for a spare a building. We urgently need trauma medicine. It's getting low, but at the same time, as far as I know... Oh, we do need trauma medicine. Okay, there's more on this list than I thought. It's because they take so damn long to go through, isn't it? Where did these guys come from? I thought we'd, we'd dealt with everyone. Okay, let's, let's go back to... Uh, Let's reassess that. We do need trauma medicine. Um, no preference, no preference. He would like to work there, but he reduces the build time. So we'll put him in there. And we'll put you on shift two, so you start working straight away. So they're working their way through. Let's just see if they can produce just enough to keep us above the limit until we've got this thing built. Sir, engineers reached the engineering depot. And we'll see if we can just scrape by on that. It's kind of a tricky balance just to, to get everything done. Oh, who's in the... There's an engineer in the pharmacy straight away. Damn him. If I wasn't so desperate for food, I wouldn't really worry about this. What time of day is it? 2.23. I'll take him out until he rests, and then once yeah, he recovers, the we'll put him back in on the 12-hour system. 
Oof. Oh, this is not good. Fears the patient's eyes were heavily contaminated by the chemical agent. I fear that if we don't treat this now, he'll become blind. It's going to be expensive thing, this. Right, okay, so what have we got? When night fell, the scouts were ready. To their surprise, the Germans seemed to be relaxed and did not pay much attention to their surroundings. One by one, they were taken out by the scouts. Not even a single bullet was shot. The scouts found some documents and orders for the soldiers when they searched the camp. They seemed to be part of an operation called Forest Pitfall. Their orders were to clear out all the villages around an area marked on the map, but there was no information about the operation itself or its purpose. Go to the location marked on the German map. We'll investigate this further. It's an opportunity to get some real intel here. Uh, plus two. We're going to do some up heavy upgrading after this. If we have the time to do it, this is. Right, that's okay. So, right. For, for once, this side is fine. So let's come out of there. And we go into... Oh, I've already moved them off. Yeah, he's had enough time. <laughs> he's back in. Let's put him on there. And let's send him to work. Go on then. He can get working. They'll all go off shift in a bit. But that's fine. I just really want to get that finished. It's been hanging Sir, over me for ages. Is cured. Oh, we need to personally send Sir, the scout there. The yeah, okay. This... You're dead right. It was... Which one was it? Rumours of Doom? Recently abandoned farm that could be checked out. No, Escape from Paradise? Yeah. Sir, unit have started it annoys me that when you, we, you tick those options, it doesn't instantly assign the scout. Alright, save game. What have we got this time? This is the surgeon. He has steady hands, which is good. Works more efficiently. Tires slower. And lowers chances for complications. That's a really good one. Works better. Yeah. Tires slower and lowers chances for complications. Sir, patient is cured. We've got some good surgeons. Uh, schedule a longer recovery. Infection's not as serious. High hopes for his recovery. Dehydration and emaciation. Yeah, that's fine. That's morale. And a better chance of recovery. So we'll take that. Who's exhausted? Oh, it's been the nurse. Okay. Okay, so in she goes. <laughs> she can do some work on there. At least we have a spare to swap out now when things go critical. Sir, nurses are on the way. Alcohol production is low and that's limiting our creation of medicines. Sir, nurses reach the hospital. And I'm going to, once again, I'm going to click on this. Depot in use. Fetch the truck. Don't know how to do it. Cancel the truck. Can't cancel the truck. I think that's bugged. Oh, we can see the truck there. It's sitting in the river. All right. I can't... It would... I don't know. I just don't know. It says depot income. If you guys keep an eye on it, if you ever see this increase by 10 all at once, let me know. And then we know that that's working. So the bullet stopped on the bone, shorter operation. Sir, and there's another one straight fire. afterwards. Shorter rehab or decreased cost. I'll go for decreased cost. Because Sir, um, I want to stockpile a few of these before the next battle comes in. Come on, engineers. Sir, operation was successful. See, if this gets to the... Well, I do need to keep creating supplies, don't I? Because we need to stockpile them. Oh, there's still somebody else to go in here. This is fine. We can do this now. This is also fine. And someone good. Good. Okay. So this is this is working. This is working fine. We're, we're back on track of things. What the hell is this? Oh, is this TB? Sir, may I have a moment yeah. of your time? I do need to prepare for chapter three, certainly. Really? Right. 
What is on your mind, Head Doctor? Pause. I'll slow down. It's... Seems that some unknown disease has started to spread among civilians. <sighs> and I am becoming more and more concerned about it. Till today, I considered it as nothing more than an inconvenience. However, today, one of the sick died because of the disease. This is concerning, I agree. Unfortunately, we do not have the means to help the civilians with diseases. That is what concerns me the most, sir. I fear that the disease could spread to the soldiers and patients, and we are not prepared to handle outbreaks. That is why I would like to delegate a few people to study the disease and send the results to HQ. This should help us discover what we are against. Yeah, we can go for that. I can send a nurse. One physicians and one nurses will be unavailable for 12 hours. We can't do that yet. We might be able to soon. I don't have a second physician, which is really bad. The nurse we can afford, absolutely. Uh, let's take a look in here then. Sir, so the physicians... Cured. It's possible, actually, in four hours' time, I think we can do this. Um, and we will get something very useful as a reward, I'm assuming. I hope. So, okay, so it's not going away. Sir, new patient arrived. Please don't be on the green. It's on the green one. <laughs> well, it's not going away. It doesn't have a timer. So maybe it, it doesn't disappear. Maybe it's something that we have to do at some point. I'm going to save the game now in case this goes wrong. Save. And then uh, we'll see if we can do that once we get that list cleared. I would love Patient is cured. points to do this, but we've got seven hours left on this upgrade. Come on, gang. Do you know what we're going to do? Right, we're going to set off the orders to, to use up some resources so we're not wasting them. So, the ones we wanted... If I do that, that's 10 orders. But that leads to... That leads to that, and it leads to that. So, improve. And all I need to do is throw one person on it at the moment. Like that and assign it. And it, it burns the resources and we're good. So, go back to assignment. And we put them back in there. The young guy speaking sounds like Henry of... Uh, Henry of KC? Henry... Which one Henry do you mean? Oh, Henry of... Um, not Henry for, of, of Scalitz from um, Kingdom Come Deliverance. This was a nice clean wound. Understood. So this is going really well. We're going to be absolutely fine for this. We're going to make use of all those drafts. I'm thinking the morale could do with being a bit better, but that should increase naturally over time. Whew, there's just more upgrades to do. So many more. This game is so brutal. Sir, Doctor is starting a new shift. Oh, hang on. Sir, may I speak with you? Of course. What is on your mind? The plague that broke out, sir. It is taking a heavy toll on the civilians. Yes, I am aware. Then, I would like to propose that we start admitting them for treatment. I understand that we are a military hospital, and that our priority are soldiers. Then you should understand that. But it pains me to see them suffer so much, sir. I know our supplies are not limitless, but I think the hospital can manage to treat at least some of them. Please consider it, sir. This is all I ask. Sir, operation was successful. Agree to treating civilians.
Hmm. All right, let's throw it in. I mean, let's. The game is difficult enough, but let's make it really difficult. And of course, of course, this is where they come in. Well, I've agreed. <laughs> let's throw it in there. We desperately need another physician, so I need I need the staff requisition orders. Otherwise, I let them all die and I send this guy away for 12 hours, Sir, but... New patient arrived. Who have we got? Civilian? No, it's a soldier. Sir, patient is cured. Maria, yeah, I know, was suffering with soldier casualties. I thought the game wasn't hard enough. <laughs> I thought I'd make it a bit more tricky. We'll throw everything in there. Save and see if anyone dies if you send him away for 12 hours. The trouble is it's 12 hours back on the on the operating um, list, isn't it? It's 12 hours of time. And that's that's quite tricky. But anyway, we'll see what we can do. I was born in a military hospital, although we weren't at war at the time or on the front line. But civilians do sometimes go through military hospitals. And they did that one. It was actually joint military and civilian hospital, but... Technically, it was a military hospital. Right, five hours. Five hours we've got. Oh, secret plans, okay. Take some time, but the scout team finds the center point of the operation. Deep in the woods, it looks it's like some sort of German camp is being prepared. There are multiple trucks with equipment standing at the center of the camp. At least two platoons worth of soldiers were working on some kind of excavation. It seemed like the Germans were preparing for an advanced position. Based on the pattern of excavation, there will be a double trench line and at least one line for mortar positions. The work was only beginning and it would take the Germans at least a week or two to finish it, but the commander knows that the sooner they destroy this camp, the better. Report your findings to HQ. We get 10 orders. Sir, scout unit is starting that's, the new mission. That's... I don't want 10 orders. I don't. And what I want is staff points. Doctor is starting a new shift. Doctor's come in. Uh, decreased cost of the procedure. Yes. Because we are short on these quite quite desperately. Sir, engineers reached the construction site. This was an easy operation. And followed by... An infection. Decreased cost. We're going to... Oh, God. Yeah. This was another easy operation. Let's slow this down. It's going too fast. I'm going to have to order some parts, I think. I don't think we can get through this. So let's go. Let's go food. Well, let's take a look at the schedule, actually. We've got a bit of food and some more resources coming in. Um, actually, it's 16th and 17th of August, so there's, there is some more food. Uh, what we need is probably surgical supplies, and it's it's these, isn't it? Well, it's these, but these are so expensive. I'll order some to get us through. There's six orders just, just gone like that. Having said that, we can't build what we've got queued, so we can maybe do this. I'm going to have to go back and put those engineers on 24-hour shifts, I think. And I'm going to get some food rations just to keep us coming in so 10 orders it's okay we've got another 10 orders coming in so the engineers they're 91% done with this that is so so close we're nearly there I'm gonna have to assign a load to this job I think for what we're producing 0.6 food an hour here I think their time can be spent elsewhere better and we just order the food in. Because that's not making much difference at all, is it? I want that finished as fast as possible. And then we need to start working on the... I don't know what that is. One of them's probably the... We need that finishing before this comes in. And that's going to be a big challenge. Sir, engineers reached the 
engineering depot. Shorter operation. Yeah, yes, please. Right, why are the medics tired? Gimgork, I should wash my ears. I wonder for like a minute what food Russians are. Ah. <laughs> Sorry, am I not talking very clearly? Food Russians. Yeah, we eat, Rus we eat Russians. We do. Once they retired from the war, there was all these Russians kicking about, and we decided to eat them to, to help our troops survive on the front line when the corned beef ran out. They are quite nourishing. Tasted of vodka. Uh, let's have a look. What am I looking for here? The medics. I think it's the medics that are exhausted. So we've got lots in the casualty clearing station. These guys... Wow. Okay, that's, that's a problem over there. I don't think we need so many in here anymore. They can get on with that. I'm sure those two between them can cope with that. 28 people waiting to... That is bad. Extremely exhausted. Let's take them out. I think we can go all the way down to just one team on this. Still wounded outside. Let's go 24 hours and I'm just going to put three teams working all together. Four teams because I don't think anyone needs to be there. There's nobody there at the moment. So let's get Sir, that going. Medics are on the way. What have I done? Sir, operation was oh, it's someone else. Yeah, it's somebody else here. So let's switch these two out again. Sir, nurses are on the way. Sir, operational there is not successful. enough medicine. Sir, I do have some ordered. Cemetery is understaffed. There's a lot of patients in here waiting for a decision. Oh my god. Right. Okay, so these are civilians, but they are quick to treat. They are very quick to treat. There is absolutely no way we're going to save this poor chap. So, he's gone. The stable... They would get through really fast, wouldn't they? But they're going to use a lot of medicine. I'm going to have to get that produced. Commander Geridos, you're going through chapter 1. 95% morale. It's so much better when it's not bugged. I'm glad that's working. I've got V-Sync turned on on mine, but I mean, it could work different with different people's hardware, couldn't it? Uh, that's going to be a problem there. I wish the game... Imagine if we'd sent this guy away. Imagine how bad that would be. Right, you are well rested, so you can get on with that one. And you're in good condition. <laughs> I'm going to have to spend Sir, some bits. Patient is cured. We got some bits in. I'm going to have to spend Sir, some more. New patient arrived. I just don't think there's any way around this. So there's another six gone. It's just to try and top up what I've got creating in my own stuff. Oh, we got something done. We got something done. Come on, assignment, engineers. So we've got the casualty clearing station two, or the advanced. What was the casualty clearing station two? Let me have a look. Under healing. Re that's rehab. Uh, it's this one. So that's the big one. Right, that's the really expensive one. We don't need that as much as we need the little one. So, the advanced dressing station. So engineers, get this done really quick. And then we can get the ambulances one done. And then we can start working on this. But we'll get people working back in this pretty quickly, I think. Do we have houses for more engineers? Can't remember. We'll take a look. So schedule a normal recovery because we want the morale. We want to bank that because it's going to go horribly wrong in a day's time. Uh, let's have a look. Patient has a very high temperature, but unfortunately we still don't know the exact cause. He may not survive. Use cooling compressors to decrease the temperature. Oh, we have someone leveled up. Let's see what we can get there. So the scouts coming home is, is good. 
The game is so stingy with, with this, isn't it? And recruiting new stuff. So this is... Works slightly less effectively, tires slightly less. Tires slower when working solo. We should have him working by himself. Work significantly better when working with others. Work better at the cemetery. I mean, I, I could put them in the cemetery. Working by themselves on a 24-hour shift. Um, perform better at ADS. They won't be working solo there. They work significantly better at the cemetery. Go on then. These, that's going to be my cemetery team. Let's go on the medic teams. He's exhausted, so let's take him out of there. So you guys can go in there. So they're working better and working slo solo and should tire less as well. There's still someone wounded outside here, which is, which is shockingly bad. Do you know what? Let's put... I know they work better when solo, but let's try and get this backlog shifted. So we might need some industrial building equipment. There's quite a few people in there. Sir, medics are on the way. Did I... I did do the engineer thing, didn't I? Are they all resting? No, they just haven't arrived there yet. That's fine. Okay, we're watching that. Sir, medics reach the cemetery. Sir, medics are on the way. Right, let's get them those bodies buried. There's not enough medicine. Ah, uh, that's to do with my engineers. This is going to be a shame, but we're producing a little bit. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll put the engineers onto 24-hour shifts for the time being. Um, let's let's do that. We we do have to get stuff produced, and when this is finished, well, when this is finished, we can start preparing. Slight decrease to morale. That's that's okay. Anyone else waiting? There's just a huge amount on here. And it's just going to use a vast amount of medicine to deal with. I'm going to see if I can hold on. I'd better set a rest here, actually. Um, <sighs> hmm, I should, probably shouldn't have agreed to this. I, this is, yeah, I really needed a second one of these. I guess the next time you play through the game, you would know this was coming and you would, you would plan for that. Oh, sorry, Commander Jerry. Don't worry about, um, <laughs> don't worry about yeah. Nightbot there. They're just a little bit, uh, Sir, it's my moderation bot. Cemetery is understaffed. They need more medic teams. I put them all in there. Someone else. Oh, God. Okay, so what have we got now? More civilians. So there's more civilians coming in that we just can't treat. Should I just put them all in the denied treatment box? I think that might be where they have to go eventually. Right, I think... Sounds like a fight somewhere. Right, let's go to this. So this would be really nice. This is the Casualty Clearing Station 2. Actually, no, it wouldn't. What we absolutely need... What does that do? Or was I going to look at the wrong one? That looks nice. But the one I wanted was... It's this, doesn't it? So this one... Well, that's nice in itself, but this, this one here... Allows ambulances to transport wounded to CCS. Improve that. And we want this before this comes in. So I'm going to throw in. In the staff lodging. Everyone. And it will take a while. It's another four hour one. Sir, engineers reach the construction site. Ah, oh, God, I, I feel like I'm hanging on by my fingertips now. This chapter was going so well at the start. Sir, new patient arrived. Ten patients. 
Well, soldiers get priority. If this is TB, then we have years to treat this, potentially. <laughs> it's not necessarily a fast-acting disease. All right, so let's put you in here. This is the one side that we're dealing well with. And this we can, we can cope with. So get those wounded people dealt with. Eight patients, I know. I know, unless HQ is gonna send me some of this, we're doing nothing. What do I get as a reward for this? It has to be a physician, doesn't it? It's a shame that it can't be any surgeon because I, I could deal with that. Shame. Wealthy, you were afraid this chapter was going to be a walk in the park? Yeah, I think I'm... Sir, operation was successful. Well, okay. I don't know what I can do, actually. I, I can't... You can't create the staff requisitions, can you? Uh, let's have a look. Couldn't find the exit wound for the bullet. Further examination reveals that the bullet is still in the wounded man's body. Order the doctor to locate it manually, but we have an x-ray device, which is why we built the damn thing. So this was an easy operation. So morale's raising back up, which is great, because we're gonna need it when that kicks off. Let's have a look in the rehab center. I haven't been in there in, in ages. So everyone's just going straight into center HQ. So if I wanted to buy some more bits with the orders, we're about to get like the best part of 16. Sir, patient is cured. So I am going to order a stack of food. Where's the food rations? There we go. I'm going to spend all of that. And we can hopefully ignore Sir, food for cured. a little bit. And we'll get my engineers Sir, back on this. If I can assign two engineers to building the advanced casualty thing. Um, well, I don't think I can. I'm going to need the medicine here. But we're going to try. Can you not swap a doc to a trauma unit? Sadly not. No. It's just the... It's just the option. I, ch I chose to... Uh, recruit a uh, trauma specialist rather than the physician early on. We could have gone either way. At the time, it seemed like trauma was the way to go because they took a lot longer to treat. Maybe with hindsight, Sir, patient is cured. would have been wise to do the other way, but we didn't know what was coming. Sir, so we lost this patient. Someone's died. That's a shame. Come on, it's nearly done. It's nearly done. And Sir, operation was right. The garage has been constructed. So, straight to improvements, because I think we can probably afford some new stuff. So that was to give me, allows ambulances to transport the wounded. So I'm, I'm hoping that's going to help. This is the trauma ward. Oh, I'm glad I didn't use that. Holy crap, if I'd improved that, we'd have got better success chances, but we'd, been use, we'd be using a lot more meds. So that was lucky I didn't go for it. And this is the breathing enhancing machine. Oh, what would this do? The low pressure gas tanks. But this looks like this might be um, something important coming soon. What's the end of that one? Decreases operation difficulty. There is the tuberculosis vaccination. Triple shift system. We can't go down those yet, but we've got work going on there. So we've also got the casualty clearing station. That would be a good one to improve. It just decreases the speed of the patient condition by 10%. And that one's another 10%, but in two things. So that's a good one to get. And that's patient rehab, which we can afford not to touch at the moment. So I'm going to go with, I don't want the emergency measures. I'm going to go with this one. It's quick. 
And that, um, come on, on the staff lodging, out you get again. Come on, guys. Sign. It'll be a while before that gets fixed. Your survival ratio is great. Maybe it wouldn't be if you didn't have the trauma guy. Don't kick yourself. Is that good? Because we're, we're not... It's a bit less than two-thirds are surviving. So I don't know if that's good. I've got nothing to judge it against, though, so... Can we just pick the improvement that reduces ration consumption? Yes, that would be a nice one. So I've spent a load on rations. Sir, patient is cured. We've got some emergency supplies in. This is going to kick me in the ass any minute now, because I'm going to put all the engineers Sir, on production. Was successful. Sir, new patient arrived. It's about to kick off big time here. Everyone's going out. I think the upgrades are about to stop. Three doctors are awaiting... Oops, I'm in the wrong thing here. Yeah, I, if only, if only I could, like, assign them to this, but... Oh, God, I thought that was my nurse then. It might be my nurse. This, this one is serious. These are all serious. Right. How many is going to survive if I do this? This was a terrible mistake, wasn't it? But I can possibly do this? Those are still good, so that's okay. Right, it's less than an hour. He's not going to get exhausted from this. You can't assign over six patients to one doctor. They're not about to go critical. So let me see. All this is going to do is cost us a load of materials. Tourniquet construction was finished. Perfect, right. Let's get into this. Um, engineers. I'm going to put you on there by yourself. <laughs> so from there, we're going to go... We're going 24-hour shifts. And we're just going to solidly work on these. And that's all we can do. We're doing 1.6 per hour, which is not going to keep pace with the demand. I can order some more. To be quite honest. Can we do this? We're out of alcohol. Uh, let's put them in there. Oh, we've only got one spot for there. Right, 24 hour shifts then. And there's trauma meds, which we're currently okay for. So I'm going to keep one guy in reserve. Okay, let's see if we can do this. I'm going to make an emergency order. No, I'm not. This could be the Spanish flu. It could be it could be TB as well. I'm regretting agreeing to look at those civilians now. game definitely is made to challenge me. There's no doubt about that. The patient is suffering from dysphosgene intoxication. He's experiencing severe respiratory issues, including pulmonary emphysema. There's little we can do for him without the use of advanced procedures. Oh, I can't do that. That's... Sadly, I can't do that, and we don't have the pressure tanks. Okay, let's, let's do that one. Um, I was going to go here and order just a few more. It's going to use all my orders up, but it's it's so expensive doing this. Let's see, who else can we throw out? Right, everyone's waiting there, so that bit's okay. The food side is going to be okay. These bits we'll manage with... The scouts are coming back with a load of orders, which we will need. And at the casualty clearing station, someone is exhausted. Jeez, that's, that's, I, I. The flipping cemetery isn't on the screen, so you don't see it. Um, right, we're going to put someone into there. And you are actually... 
fine at the moment. So just keep on going like that. So these are these are bad. Being as tired as that. Um, I guess you can work on a 12 hour shift until the fight comes. I want to try and get people rested up for the fight. Which is going to about five minutes time. Sir, medics are on the way. Yeah, that's, that's not good at all. Three doctors are awaiting new assignments. Oh, well, we've got one regular. So we can definitely treat one. Uh, it's not suggesting that anyone's going to die from this. So these will go rushing through fast. It's just a, a shame that they are so expensive. To tr oh, we're still at six, aren't we? Poor bastards so exhausted, they feel like shoveling their own graves. They probably dug one and jumped inside to have Sir, a quick sleep. Defensive positions! Germans are launching an attack! Here we go again. This might be the bit that finishes me off. I mean, the scouts are going to do a good job when they come back with the ten orders. That is going to be useful. That's uh, that's a load of medication I can order. I don't think at this point I can afford to build any more upgrades. I'm going to need the engineers on full production. It's a shame we haven't got gas masks, really, isn't it? So we're going to fight those guys off, which is excellent. Sir, we have wounded soldier. Tunnel is almost finished. We will strike very soon. Excellent. I hope that makes a massive difference. So let's see what the casualty situation is here. Uh, 25 wounded. That's quite a lot. Over to the medics. Right, you guys are our grave diggers. Um... 24 hours over here. We we this this is bad. Uh, I'm gonna have to 24 hour shift here. We need three teams in there, and I need to. I mean, what do we care about waiting burial really? We need to get people in. I'm hoping that we have Sir, these ambulances now right. that are gonna start recovering things faster. We do look. Ah, cool. We have one ambulance. And let's hope that works a bit quicker. High spirit, excellent morale and shorter rehab. There is literally nothing that we can we can do now. We're out of alcohol. The scout thing doesn't seem to be doing a, a, a damn thing. They're busy. This depot... Hey, it must be doing something, look. Because this has gone down. I'll click on fetch truck and I'll see what happens. So, I think that's... Maybe it is delivering? Sir, and we just don't see secure. it? I just don't know how that works. Hey, Kim Gork, you think I've got a really good ratio of dead to... I don't know. I don't know. I, I, hope, I hope you're right. I feel like other people have probably played this and done a lot better. Um, excellent. So there's one guy. I can't remember his name. Logan Mills. He likes working here. He, he would prefer to work here, which is good. I'm not getting anything in there, but anyway. And he can go work on this. This is going to be all hands to the pumps until this... Sir. This clears. There was something I was going to go and click on. Oh, the pharmacy. That was the engineers. Which is why I, I did go over there. Um, no one is looking too exhausted. She prefer to work in the operation. Right, okay. Yeah, you can go in as a spare. You can go in here now. Sorry, you would like to go in here now, wouldn't you? The second shift in a 12-hour system. We can switch that over. So she's now happy. She's now working the first shift. She's just happy because she's in there. She would like to work on an eight-hour shift system. You can go to casualty clearing. And I think 
She would prefer not to work in the operating ward and she doesn't care. Brilliant. So these are all every 24 hours, I think, they give us some morale. So everyone is set up there quite happily. Oh, she's going to get exhausted real quick, isn't she? She is working till 8 o'clock. Yeah, that's not going to work there. I'll change it when I when I have to. So who's exhausted in here? Uh, this is the one we need, so I'm going to switch you out. Um, that's a long time. I'm going to put you in for the time being. Seems like engineers are one of the, the key classes here for like, it's such an important role making the stuff. Leonidas, you'd only worry about burials if the weather is warm, otherwise just get the bodies out of sight. They're in a morgue at the moment, but I don't know if the morgue's got a maximum capacity. Have we got, we've got soldiers coming in at the bottom here, or in the middle. This is a long operation, isn't it? I'm fairly certain that uh, we're not going to get this scene to. It's less than an hour. It might be a quick in, stick your tongue out, say ah, right, out again, we can't do anything for you. It might be. I don't know. We'll see. But I, I can't do anything to get these points, which is really yeah, annoying me. Oh, hang on. Hang on, here's might be a possibility. Right. We've noticed that about an allied reconnaissance group nearby. Here we go, this is the opportunity. HQ wants to provide us with a basic health checkup. Nothing a nurse couldn't do. Yes, do it. We only get two. We'll send a nurse. We will send the one who's resting that nobody likes. A sign. Yeah, nurses are on the way. Brilliant. That's why we need the spare nurse. You're not too fond of the scout tent either. Um... Hmm, it, it could do a, it could be a bit better, I think. It could work a little bit better, the scout tent. Ah, Bartos, welcome back, welcome back. If you, can you maybe answer me something? You might know. Um, I've assigned, I've got this depot, this is in chapter two. It's a, a monastery, it's providing me supposedly 10 alcohol as income. I've assigned a truck to it. I don't really know what it does. I don't know if it's adding to my stockpile at the hospital by itself from there, or if I have to come and click fetch truck. I've tried doing that. This never seems to make any difference. This has changed. It's been at 10 for hours and hours and hours, and I look back in now and it's gone down to nine. I just don't know, and I never really see any messages and nothing seems to re respond. So if you know anything about that or whether I need to do anything differently, um, shout up because I'd be all ears. I could use Sir, the alcohol. I inform you that I left a personal recommendation. Okay, so we've got a VIP come in. Uh, this is one we can treat. This is Howard Berger. No service history. Okay, who is this then? He is from Belgium. A stray American soldier from Belgium appeared in our hospital. He claims to be a major of some kind, the Special Force of the United States Army. His uniform seems to confirm his words, but he has no documents or dog tags. According to him, his squad came under heavy artillery fire around three kilometers west, and he's the only member of his squad that survived. He appears to have deep trauma and guilt relating to the events as he was unwilling to talk about them at first. This is an exhausting operation for 15 hours. Yeah, I'll do it. I don't know anything about it. I don't believe he's American Special Forces. But he's a VIP. Um... We can put that in. He'll be exhausted afterwards. We'll put a set rest on there. But we can take that. Oh, you already talked about the, the truck and the scout thing in chat. Uh, you weren't the one who's testing it. Ah, okay. No worries. It's half past six. I've done my four hours. But I want to do a bit longer and see how this goes on because yeah. I'm enjoying it. <laughs> We're streaming again tomorrow, by the way, folks. So I'll be live again at 2.30 uh, UK time tomorrow. On YouTube, I schedule the streams on Twitch. Yeah, there's a schedule on Twitch as well now. Sir, so you can see, uh, you, can, you can watch whichever platform you prefer. Sir, 
May I inform you that I left a personal recommendation note with one of the oh, agents. Oh, did you? You're recommending people as well now. Please be this one. We can deal with these ones. This is Carl Camara. Not Chris Camara then. He's from East Suffolk. So we've got partial information about him. He's a German scientist who surrendered himself to the British forces and was wounded during capture. During the initial checkup, it was revealed that he possesses deep knowledge about chemicals, medicine, and treatment methods. Pressed about this matter, he revealed himself to be a German doctor and scientist who worked on the development of new military gases and new treatment methods for chemical injuries. Okay. Well, we can, we can certainly fix him up. He is a prisoner, Carl Camara, Camara, that was brought to your facility is considered a low priority case. As his wounds are extensive, HQ does not expect an easy operation and, although we are hoping for the best, will not enforce any penalties in the likely event of his death. I think they want him to die by the sound of that. However, um, we have no one actually... Sir, if I may, I think I will be able to convince Mr. Kamara to work in the hospital as a doctor. Oh, and he'd be a physician. He's got... Right, this is, this is where we get fixed. Because he's worked with gases and stuff. So that's, that's excellent. Why is everyone exhausted? There's an exhausted nurse. Uh, we're going to have to lose the happiness and just switch those over so she can rest for a bit. Until this one comes back. Which is fine. Morale's okay at the moment. The medics are okay. The engineers. We've got an, an exhausted engineer. That's okay. We just switch this guy out. Uh, we're not producing food. That's fine. We can live without that at the moment. And this is a very slow upgrade going on. But that's that's fine. My next free unit. Yeah, trauma doc. He's got to be, right? The game gives you curveballs but makes up with it. The thing yeah, is, though, will he, will he be recruitable in time <laughs> to work through this? We've got a load of critical people. It just says critical. It, it Oh, these are going to go through fairly fast. Right. So at this point, we've got a stable VIP. I didn't see him come in. Matthew Baker. French. Joined the military to fight in the Second Boer War. I have the pleasure to inform you that Sergeant Matthew Baker will be promoted to Sergeant Major immediately after his return to active duty. As such, I would like to suggest the quick handling of his case, as there is a need for such brave and gallant men on the front lines. I would also warn you that HQ will not take his potential loss or inability to return to active duty lightly. Right, well, it would be a shame to lose him. However, these are going through fast. And I'm going to order some more. I'm going to go to the train station and order more. Because we don't need the orders for the moment. I am literally living hand to mouth with these at the moment. The drafts. We don't need the drafts at the moment. Sir, engineers reached the pharmacy. Good. Uh, we are... There's nothing about another battle coming. Um, I'm going to hold these off. What's the, what's the job? Survive until 6 a.m. On the 23rd of August, there's going to be another battle coming, isn't there? There is absolutely going to be another battle. I'm going to hold off, though, until they're all full. And we'll see if we see it on the map, and then we can decide whether we want to release yeah. them or not. New patient arrived. Right, I think we should be treating these guys and getting them through fairly fast. There's another critical one just turned up. Oh, we can't. Can we put them in? We can't. I could take... I'm going to take him out. And put her in there. Oh, okay. They're not going to live that long. Is that somebody else? Can't help you, sorry. Uh, my VIP. will live to there. For sure. He's on the list. He's definitely on the list. We'll switch those around. Um, I will put the rest here. But we might bump him back a little bit. Because we're going to try and get 